but no, that's, that's part of the journey, really. Yeah. Is, uh, I knew it wasn't gonna be uh, wasn't gonna be the easiest thing in the world, and yeah. it's turning out not to be. So, um, you know, every step counts when we're out there. It, it, we've slowed down by a couple of days, but there's there's nothing that we can do about that now, and so we just continue from here on. So. Really, I mean, what it comes down to is we're not stopping, we're not turning around. So. And you're enjoying our wonderful weather. <laughs> the weather is fantastic. <laughs> Today, right Today. now. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's, a, there's an expression here that um, if you don't like the weather, just go for another five minutes if you're in a vehicle. <laughs> okay? And, and in, in 20 minutes, you'll experience the four seasons. That's <laughs> true. And obviously, this weekend, so we had snow in Gander. We had snow flurries here yesterday. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I and know. I was in shorts running today. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, and, and, and was the wind against you? or? It was, it was actually, I had a lot of wind with me yeah. today. Uh, lots of crosswind, but I had some, some of my back, which was nice. Wasn't that against me too, too much. Now I'm going to ask you a stupid question now, and I, I know I've read some of your... Strike your mouth. No. Yeah, I was going to say, but he's not going to be over it. <laughs> <laughs> the, the motivation for, for doing what you're doing? Um, well, you know, my uh, my mom battled cancer uh, when I was in the early teens. Wow. And, uh, she's still with us today, and I, I, I have to thank, you know, the the treatment that exists now because you know she went through surgery and went through radiation and she's still with us today and it's you know it, that that hit me really really hard especially at that age so I, I will never ever forget it and so that's a huge point of inspiration for me Keith actually is my cousin and, and both of us lost our, our grandfather um, about six years ago that was that was really really hard on our family we were a big family close family and that impacted all of us immensely. So it's it's really about I guess uh, I had a taste of you know the, the positive behind you know what the research and development has, has given us and uh, saved my mom's life and, and also the fact that not everybody can be saved by it and so let's let's get some more into it. Let's kinda rekindle our ability to to generate uh, more funds for, for the research division and, and get into you know creating more more technologies to to change some lives for the better. So, so you're you're accepting donations? And yeah. Along the way. Yeah. That's right. um, well, we uh, most of our donations that we've received so far has been online. Cancer.ca/slash the runs away business. Vanity URL to uh, it's our fundraising page for the Canadian Cancer Society. So that's all tracked. It's all tracked through our uh, that site. And um, in terms of hard copy donations, very little actually yeah. since we started, unfortunately. And uh, you know, I, I think about it every day because yes, we're absolutely out here to, to you know put some smiles on some faces and, and, and raise some hope and awareness for sure. But we're also out here to raise some money for the Canadian Cancer Society. So uh, I would love to see donations coming in every day so we can make our deposits and go. We have a mutual account uh, with the, our local Canadian Cancer Society unit in, in Peterborough, Ontario. And, you know, we donate it and then they add it to the, to the pot. So um, it's, I would love to see more. And, you know, we can <laughs> and uh, you know, even online donations, you get your tax receipt emailed to you now. It, it's yeah. it's instant, and uh, I just I would love to be able to raise some money. I guess it, it's been tough because we haven't had any any real media exposure up until today. We had an interview in Gander, and that was the very first thing that we've seen. Nobody nobody cared to uh, talk to us actually in St. John's or up until Gander. So, okay. 
that's been that's been oh, tough because you know uh, we're out here we're trying, we want everybody to know but it's the most that we can do is, is talking to people like that's up until now so hopefully you know CBC is there tomorrow and uh, I guess uh, Sue from the newspaper was here so hopefully some more people can kind of yeah. 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 So that's, that's fantastic. Roger Moulton, yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. Yeah. Well, um, I knew about your I knew about your run. I heard a lot about it prior to your start. In fact, I think. Anyways, I, I got lots of information when you were starting. I thought about it. I said, whatever happened? Mm -hmm. I haven't heard anything. I checked out the website the other day. So. Yeah, yeah, we are, we're still mobile. The website actually is, has been a tough point for us because we don't we don't have mobile internet, right? So, um, and I actually built the website. I created the whole thing. So, updating it, you need Flash. And we have an iPhone that was donated, but iPhones don't deal with, with Flash. So, um, the most that we can do is update our social media yeah. uh, sites: Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. And we can do all of that. Our, our updates on the website actually come kind of in waves whenever we can connect with some Wi-Fi. <laughs> so we've got a couple of laptops that are just, just itching to be connected to Wi-Fi whenever we're around it. So, yeah, it, it, we'll work those, those little bugs out as we go. Fantastic. Well... Do you want to do anything yeah. inside? Yeah. Yeah, so maybe we'll wait for you to do that and then we'll try and get some pictures of all of us together. Yeah, yeah sure. Yeah. Perfect. Go inside and yeah. do this here.